day this week with some festive flavors to just make you freak. Two kind of cakes, Oreo and confetti, and pink sugar again. I just wasn't ready. Candy bar cookies give us a fix. Peanut butter Snickers, caramel shortbread Twix. Let's watch Ben Mayer. All right, first on our list this week is the Caramel Shortbread featuring Twix. This is a shortbread cookie filled with Twix pieces topped with a gooey layer of caramel, milk chocolate, and then crunchy Twix pieces on top. Second on our list is the Peanut Butter featuring Snickers. This is a peanut butter cookie that has chopped Snickers topped with caramel buttercream, uh, snicker pieces and a milk chocolate drizzle and coming up next is the birthday cake featuring oreo this is a cookie made from oreo cookie pieces covered in a cake batter cream cheese frosting and topped with more oreo cookie pieces and rainbow sprinkles and of course because it's crumble's birthday we couldn't not have a confetti cake cookie well, I guess this is just a confetti cake, but this is two fluffy layers of cake batter confetti cake, then with a smooth vanilla buttercream, and then topped with a bunch of rainbow sprinkles. All right, four to try for this birthday week for Crumble. So I say we go ahead and we get the uh, Twix out of the way because I think that was like one of the first ones we ever tried I from do. Crumble. I do. I love Twix. Um, I'm just going to eat that piece. I like cookies and cream Twix or cookie dough Twix. I don't, I'm not a fan of like the regular Twix because the caramel's too caramely. I like more like caramello y caramel. All right. Let's give this a try. Mmm. Cookie soft. I love how soft that cookie is. Soft is good. Caramel sticking on top of my tooth. My but you roof. know what? They say to refrigerate this. Mm hmm. I wouldn't. No, uh, it, it I, makes I'm the a, caramel way too hard. Yeah, it makes it too hard. I'm I'm a anti-refrigerate when it comes to caramel, but like mm -hmm. other things like cheesecakes and cakes with the buttercream, I think you should refrigerate those because yep. it keeps it like firmer. Yep. But I would not refrigerate this one. But it's good. It, I get vibes of a Twix. Yep. It definitely tastes like a, a Twix. It's um, crazy how much it tastes like a Twix. With a Twix, you get more of the chocolate flavor. This one, not so yeah. much. Um, well, it's not covered in Yeah, it's more shortbread than anything else. Do you but, not want your cookie piece? No, you can have it. Um, I love you. But. Love you. <laughs> love you too. We also have, uh, we're supposed to have five this week, but being sure to we've done time and time again, so we didn't do that this week. So that'll automatically be number five. Um, but. <laughs> Let's move on to the next one and see how it fares. You want to do the other candy bar? Let's get it done and out of the way. Peanut I think it's butter funny how we featuring did two, Snickers. Yeah, we did a Twix and then we did a Snickers. Well, because when you think birthday, I'll give you more peanut butter. When you time. think birthday, you think candy bars. You do? Well, I don't know. I just think of chocolate when I think of birthday. Like I remember going to friends' birthday parties and we would go to like the movies and stuff, and their parents would be like, "Oh, grab whatever candy bars you want." So that, that's oh, that what, was when candy was I cheap think. back in the day. Yes, yeah, now we just sneak it in. But shh, we don't tell them. <laughs> crumble cookies? What? Hey, there is a crumble near a movie theater. You know what? I'm surprised we haven't tried that yet. I mean, it's a little hard to sneak a pink box into a movie theater. Put it in your purse. I don't know. I'm I'm not a fan of this one. It tastes just like a Snickers. It is, but I'm getting like it tastes I'm exactly. getting too much raw peanut taste. Well, yeah, because Snickers is different than Snickers I have that. And that I understand Snickers, but it's it's too much raw peanut butter taste for me. It tastes just like a Snickers. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I like just the buttercream. What's the buttercream? Snickers. Caramel. Snickers. It's a caramel buttercream. Fact, Snickers. I like the buttercream, the little whoop de swirl that they put on it. I like that. I'm not a fan of this cookie. I, I like the cookie more than I thought I would because I get the caramel, I get the chocolate, I get the peanut butter, and then I get the nuts that Snickers has. It, it's good. It's not as good as the Snickers ice cream bar, mind you, because that thing's fantastic. Ooh, that brings back but, memories. But that's really good. It's a lot better than what I thought it would. Wasn't my favorite. Um, I got way too much raw peanut butter or raw peanut taste. The cookie is a peanut butter cookie, um, <coughs> but it has apparently 
bits of Snickers in this. Yeah, which are so, mainly I mean, the nuts. Yeah, I mean, you can kind of see that big honking nut right there. Um, Is it me? Uh, yeah, you're the nut in the house. Um, I, I wasn't a fan of it. I like the Twix more than the Snickers, but that's where we differ. And we will debate. And that's because I just like Twix more than, and I'm a lefty Twix. So... It doesn't I matter. I the left side. They're both the doesn't same. Doesn't matter. I pro left side. So, um... That's why you're sitting on the that, left. That's why I'm sitting on the left, because I'm a lefty. But anyways, back to the cookie. Um, I like the buttercream. If you just had, like, a little taste of the buttercream, I do like it. It does taste like caramel. Just not a fan of this cookie. So, but if you like Snickers, you will probably like this cookie. It's the Snickers. So, and with that, let's move on to the next birthday celebration cookie. The question is cookie or cake? Oh my gosh. Anything with Oreo that Crumble does is amazing. So, I think we've had this one before. So it's oh, probably, we have, probably and very it's amazing. good. Yeah, probably so very good. I say we just do the cake to celebrate Crumble. Okay. So, I mean, I feel like... You get the big one there. Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, I did. Yeah, you get the big I one. I felt like we didn't get as much icing in, in the, middle. the middle layer. I yeah. mean, show your fork. There's, like, I don't want to spill I, it I mean, in my milk. I mean, that's... The, the, there oh, isn't much. Jet. It just glues it. Yeah. Um, as I'm about to lose it. Cheers. Yeah, cheers to you. I mean, that's the inside of our cake. Like, you can't even really tell there's another layer of... The icing's really good. Oh, yeah, it's buttercream. Yeah, the icing's good. Yeah, that's... It's confetti cake. I mean, it's soft, moist cake. It's got really good confetti flavor. It, it tastes like a birthday cake cake. It's so pretty. Yeah. I mean, Crumble said, you know what? For our birthday, we're going to go ahead and do a cake. And they That's, did. That is the inside of our confetti cake. Yep. Just a little you small can't layer. You can tell where it's the... It's not a big layer. You can't even tell where that second layer of... Or the first layer, I should say. Yes. Of buttercream is. So, I felt a little gypped. I would have liked to have had it look like a cake. Um... Especially since this was the piece de resistance for to this afternoon and I got chocolate on me. I don't know French. Um, seeing as this is what we're celebrating, their birthday, so I felt like we got a little gypped on our icing. But it's really good. The, I think it's a cream cheese. Let me go to I don't know. The cake is soft. The icing is delicious. Confetti doesn't add anything to it, but it's nice and pretty. So if Vanilla you, buttercream is if, all it is. Yeah, if you like cakes, you like things that are pretty, you will like this. So if it's your birthday this week, like Crumble, you got to go get yourself a sprinkle cake. Yeah. If it's your birthday, get busy. Get a birthday cake. Get a birthday cake. Uh-oh. I'm finishing my birthday cake. You never know when this thing starts to record. Oh, well. On to the last one. On Oreo. On to the last one. This one I've been waiting for. For years? Oreo. Well, no, since they told us about it last week. This always reminds me of The Wizard of Oz. Oreo. Oreo. Rio. Okay, let's go. Cheers. <laughs> I mean, this is, this to me is like the cookie I'm going for this week. Mmm. So good. Mmm. The Oreo, I love. It is a soft Oreo cookie. <coughs> I think it's the cream cheese frosting. Cake batter cream cheese. Ooh, so let's try that one again. Cake batter cream cheese. <laughs> mm, that does taste like cake batter. And then just crushed up Oreos on top and little sprinkles just to make it look like a birthday celebration. Kudos, I love it. There's enough said. It's just a mic drop right there. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that cookie. Solid cookie, really great icing. However, no. the icing on the confetti cake, just if I pick icing alone, this icing tasted better than I, that icing. Like the, It's just vanilla. I know, but it's this really is, amazing this out is there. This cake batter. I know, that's why I was shocked. This tastes like, as you always say, grandma's you know icing homemade. That, that icing is really fantastic. Like That was like, wow. The, this with the Oreo makes it 
fantastic, like perfect kind of cookie. I love the Oreo icing better. Well, I like the icing with the, the cookie. I think that's what makes that icing oh, yeah. really good. This here is just fabulous. That's I mean, just that a vanilla. Frosting. It's a vanilla frosting. Oh, it's good. Okay, it is nothing compared it to is so good. chocolate frosting. It's good. So this should now be we very have to sit here easy and deliver. Oh no, it will not be. Oh, this is gonna be a piece of cake. <laughs> but um, <laughs> moving on. But first, it's milk time because you can't have a birthday cake without some milk. Cheers. You know, if we were doing birthday, why couldn't they have done something with strawberry? Like they do amazing strawberry cookies and cakes and all that stuff. They should have done like a strawberry. Never in my entire 44 years of life for my birthday did I say, you know what? I want something strawberry. I'm sure there are people out there. This guy is not one of them. German I mean, chocolate, chocolate that chip, been good. mint chocolate chip, Ooh. cookies and cream. I mean, come yeah, on. See, but that's what I'm saying. We could have done a milkshake. Salted shake. caramel. Come on. There's so many more things I would have thought of to do for a birthday. But than... it's Crumble's birthday, and they can do the, the way they want to. It's your birthday, mm -hmm. and you can do what you want to. Yeah. Do what you want to. I'm, you would cry too if it happened to you. I, I'm, I'm about to cry. All right, we got four this week because we're not doing pink sugar. Uh, so you guys go ahead and start with shortbread featuring Twix. I think it's this one. Yep. I'm, I'm correct. The cookie is nice and I like Twix. But the caramel, it has sticky one. I'm not a big fan of that one. If it was just like the good caramel, that would be good. But that like, doesn't sit to your mouth like you're trying to bite it. Because like when you're trying to bite a cookie, you don't want the, like, the, you don't get the top of like, your mouth. This is a pain to get off. If it had a better caramel, I'd love it more, but it's good. All right, let's do peanut butter featuring Snickers. There's a lot of stuff featuring stuff. You see it cookie? I like the icing and then they had a chocolate on it, that was good. And that little piece of I think Snickers was it? Oh that was very good. And the Snickers would go with the chocolate, but just this is an okay cookie. Alright, let's go the Oreo birthday cake cookie. Cookie is nice and chocolatey. The sprinkles and like the crumbles on top is really good. And the frosting, really sweet and light. Very soft cookie. Very good icing. And I like to think that they had um, sprinkles and they had cookie bits on the top. It's very good. All right, last is Crumbles birthday confetti cake. Is it like their birthday this week or something? It is. Ooh, Happy birthday, birthday Crumble. You guys ate to them. For me, I like birthday cake, and it's really good. I also agree. I like birthday cake, and yeah, it's very good for me. All right, so what's your favorite this week? Birthday cake. The cake? Yeah, that one. It's properly pronounced confetti cake. No. Yeah, is that also your favorite? Uh -huh. All right, thanks guys. So, coming in number five is the one we didn't try this week because we know it's number five. Pink sugar. Sorry, pink sugar. You're just a sugar cookie with pink icing. Now, if that pink icing were strawberry, maybe Ooh. we'd come after it. Ooh. Number four. The shortbread featuring Twix. That's right. Yeah. Good cookie. Great chocolate. Caramel sugar. The caramel is what just puts it in the every time. You gotta have the creamy caramel, not the sticky caramel. That's just crumble. I, I've I'm, only I'm a beating few cookies a, beating get, a dead uh, horse here. Only a few cookies get the good caramel. Yeah, it's caramel sad. Caramel caramel. 
Uh, damn, it makes me wonder. Care? How do you pronounce it? Let us know. Uh, coming to number three was... How, how would you type that out anyways? Caramel, is, they're all going to be typed the same. No, because people are going to be like caramel or caramel. Going back to the cookies. Number three, then, would be the peanut butter featuring Snickers. Yes. For candy, like, candy mixed with cookies. Uh, candy turned cookie. Yeah, it, it's never the best. I mean, there's a few that they've done really well, but, I mean, Snickers and Twix are just meh. Like, why not Three Musketeers? I'd like to see a Three Musketeers be done. Because they're like fluffy nougat. That'd be awesome. Ooh. I'd want a Heath bar. Like a toffee. Yeah, that'd be good. That'd be yummy. Okay, going back. Um, coming in at number two this week would be the... Crumbles birthday cake. The confetti cake. Happy cake. birthday. Happy birthday, Crumble, but we felt this one was number two this week. So need, that means... Need oh, more icing. <clears throat> yeah, ours needed more icing. In the middle. And, like, it... It's really goopy. Yeah. Like it's like we had to pull it off with a spatula because like if you try to pick it up, it's all sticky. So like there needed to be a bottom or something. It's almost like a trust like life paper. Case. Yeah. Um it's really pretty though. I mean it completely celebrates your birthday. Again, birthday is just oozing out of it, but it's just <laughs> Kind of a few things were just kind of hit or miss with it, but our dun, 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 number, number one. one which was the birthday cake featuring Oreo. <coughs> Oreo birthday cake. Nothing wrong with that. That's something I could definitely see myself getting for a birthday cake is an Oreo birthday cake. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yep. So good pick on that one. So those were our picks this week. Yeah, so for your birthday out there, what do you go for? What's your go-to dessert for your birthday? We'd love to know. Just let us know. Anything with chocolate. And now we've got to see, will this week of birthday flavors be outdone by next week? Only time will tell. All right, next week we got five flavors to try. The one that I know you are so not looking forward to, oatmeal chocolate chip. Mm -mm. It's, it's oatmeal. It's chocolate chip. Meh. Yeah. Uh, now that it's fall, this one will make you excited. Pumpkin cake cookie. Ooh, I love pumpkin. I, if I recall, that's the one that does not have an icing, so it's just a thick, like, pillowy pumpkin Ooh. cake cookie. So I might be taking some icing off another. So there's one with a cream cheese. There will definitely be yes. a monstering happening. Yes. Happening. The return of our number one cookie, Cookies and Cream Milkshake, is back next week. I'm so excited. That is the best cookie. Um, we haven't found anything that's beaten that flavor, so we'll see. Uh, and then next week, we got two limited time offerings. One, which is blueberry crumb. It looks like a cake. You're like... If so you all come in the square thing. Yes. And, and like for those of you who grew up in the 90s and high school, they like hostess had the blueberry muffin loaf that you could get. And it's like a little wrapped package. I'm dating myself here, but it's probably I very similar to that. And then the one that is piquing my curiosity is a brownie sundae. Think brownie in a square pan, dollop of butter, kind of like how the waffle has a dollop of butter on it. Chocolate glaze on top and a cherry. Ooh. Now that would have been something for our birthday this week. It's not a cake, it's a Sunday. But people have Sundays on their birthdays. Or for the summer, so I don't know why it's in the fall. But still, it I will give points to creativity because it like from the pictures I've seen, it looks pretty cool. Ooh, I can't wait to see that. Yep. So that's what we got coming next week. Are you excited? I am. Let us know. And that'll do it for this week. So it was Crumble's birthday. What did everyone think? Very good. Very good. I love birthday cake stuff. Mm -hmm. And thanks celebrating birthdays. Yeah, celebrating birthdays good. So Crumble from us to you. Happy birthday. birthday. <laughs> Mine didn't explode. Ah! One more. It won't go. All over the computer. Oh, it smells like Finally. burning. Yeah. In with, this house. Don't, Why did it go? Don't recommend doing that when you're no. eating cookies. That wouldn't be good. Wow. <sighs> Oh, that was cool. That was like 3D, but not. That was not 3D. <laughs> Whee! All right, so here we go. Happy birthday, Crumble. Whee! What are you supposed to be like? Hold on, we have more. Here, we have more. Happy birthday, Crumble. Woo! Okay. All right. That'll just about do it. So as far as we're concerned, Ben. Mayor. Done that. See you next time. Bye. Bye. Thanks for watching our video. We really appreciate it.
appreciate you watching it Don't forget to like and subscribe Subscribe to Ben Mare Done That.